Hello YouTube, this is Minecraft DNA here with another video on my iPod. And this one is more of like an uh like an update of the tutorial that I showed you on how to get the IMCP E edit because um because the source that I gave you, um City whatever entire dot you know, um whatever it was doesn't have it anymore, so I'm here to show you the new way of doing it and you'll need another source um so yeah here we go um and oh my bad go to oh so what you want to do is from Cydia you want to from the home page well you want to open Cydia and then from the home page you want to go to manage down the bottom and you'll come up to this click sources and you'll come up to this page and as you can see um you might not be able to see the entire Re, uh, source because I deleted it because it only had that um, MCP patch on it um, and that didn't really it like didn't really work I guess oh well it it did but like it's it's sort of like since 0 0.3.3 .3 came out um, the patch got the fire patch got fixed oh, I mean fire bug got fixed and then but it did have some stuff about the multiplayer um, but I didn't know how to use that so it's not useful to me and plus I it would be really horrible playing multiplayer over online because like you won't be able to talk to them uh, but anyway um, so what the source you're gonna need is that one right there um, so I'm gonna try and position it right and go edit add and yes so city it dot my repo space dot com my repo space dot com forward slash entire spout is the last one and then forward slash again and then you click add source let it do its thing and it'll you know load all the files I mean not all of them because there's only one and that is oh so so once it's loaded you'll it'll pop up in your list um click onto it and then you'll see one file and it's it doesn't have like IMCP it it has the random name and then it just has an description uh, inventory editor for Minecraft PE but anyway click into that and where mine says modify where I'm highlighting in the top right um yours will say install click on that and click confirm and then it'll do its thing again click return to Cydia or do whatever it tells you and then once you've done that you click out quit out of Cydia um, go to wherever your um, your thing is fine just scroll across your pages and you'll find it uh, mine's in my Minecraft folder but <clears throat> you go into that and here it is here it is guys so um, yeah so watch, watch. So you come up first with um, with a list of your all your worlds. Um, as you can see, there's all my worlds. Um, I have the ultimate sky block there, um, the normal sky block, my endless project, giant house, which I have been working on, and I I am dedicated to show a video. Um, I just have like a little, a few more things to go like the windows and such but I have been doing some windows and I need to do the front porch if I'm going to do that so I need to sort of finish it a little bit sorry it's been taking so long but anyway I'll carry on so say if I wanted to do v0.3.2 world um, so you would you would click into it you will come into the world data um, inventory location player time um, so I'll go into world data, it, you can change its level name, um, you can change it from survival to creative, um, remove mobs, um, show it, you show its random seed, um, last played, and size on disk, I don't know what that number is about, and platform iOS, so I'm on iPod, obviously, and then seven slots, but that's just a joke, um, it's, you know, IMCP it has some humor, how you get your seven slots iPad ha 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 but you know oh how many slots does 
does it have now since the new update came out i forgot but anyway so you want to click in the inventory this is what you are probably really looking for for two for two um in this app um so what you you'll see all the items that you have in your um what is it in your inventory at the moment and so what you want to click is press plus and see how every time i click plus it'll just come up with a stone which is like another item or another slot in your inventory so what you want to do is click on a stone and go and as you can see you come up with id count and damage um id you can if you know the id of the item that you want click then type in the id um or else you can just scroll down find it um or you can type it in so sword i'll just type in sword and it comes up with diamond sword you know this was really useful um in when you couldn't mine stuff so oh you can get a camera i think yeah yeah camera um so yeah there you go i don't know which new ones have been added oh like the arrow wasn't there before if i quit out how do i quit out I quit out quit out no dang it oh my gosh i can't i can't quit out i done okay so feather fence yeah so there's just heaps of stuff oh that's what i might be able to do i should since i can't spawn animals i wonder if you can spawn animals um moss stone no we don't want that um sheep that would be really cool oh man come on man that would be so cool oh man if only you could do that that'd be that'd be awesome um but anyway yeah you can spawn lots of stuff um just go check it out uh and so after you've done that you want to click oh so yeah so once you've done that you want to click done when you're typing in the count so the oh, i mean return so if i want 67 of them click return or else it won't work um and then there you go right there there's my moss stone and so i'm just going to level those stone there so you click back again and then what you want to do is you want to click save in the top right so click that saving completed and then there you go so you can also change your location your position or your spawn point so this is when you like die or something there those numbers down the bottom is where you're going to spawn again so say if you're creating like a custom map and you wanted them to spawn or to start off in a certain position you would walk to that position you would get the numbers from your position on the top row and then you would just write them down in the spawn point and you would spawn exactly where you were um where you're positioned um if you know what i mean it's sorry if you don't but I can't make it any clearer than that. Um, so player, air, don't know what all that's about, but you guys can play with that if you want to. Um, time, in-game time, I'm, I think that's like the only one that really matters. Death time, yeah, I don't really know what that's all about, but there you go, guys. So remember to click save and go back and yeah, so there it is. Um, oh, also you would so after you've done that you click saved and everything if you have Minecraft open So there see how I have the game open you want to click this you want to end the process So this would restart restart the game and enable it to work. So This is it for this video. I'm not going to show you um, if I have it in my inventory All I know is that it does work um, So go please try it out and rate this video subscribe for more Go check out my other channel or other videos on my channel. Um, and as always, oh wait, wait, almost forgot. I just want to make a big shout out to um, M4 Magnitude 805, I think. <laughs> Dang it, I forgot. I think that's it. Or 806. No, I think it's 805. Um, anyway, because he's the one who showed me. And he's he's got a video up on about it, but it wasn't getting too much views. So I asked him to oh, to see if I could um, post the video because it, it is really handful, handy. Um, so yeah, go check him out. I think he's only got one video up. That's the last time I checked, but um, he might have more up. Go check him out. 
um, help him along on his YouTube journey. And as always, have a good day, or if you're watching it at night, have a good night and a good night's sleep. Minecraft DNA out. Laters. Oh.